What's going on, everybody? This is Bojack. I'm actually playing What Remains of Edith Finch. Hope to God that's not copyright music. I'm on a boat, mother... What Remains of Edith Finch. Edith Finch. How do I... What do I do? Oh. So I'm in the forest. I'm also going to be looking at little details of the game to see how well they actually did on... I here until I was 11, but I wasn't allowed inside half the rooms. Okay. No trespassing. That's yeah, too late for us. We're already dead. In her will, my mother left me a key, but didn't tell me what I'd unlocked. Okay. Maybe she thought I'd know. Or... She thought the mystery would be enough to bring me back. And the plot thickens. I don't know what's going on. The finches. I want to go this way. It beckons me. The truth is, even after I inherited the house, I never thought I'd come back to it. But so, now I had questions about my family that only the house knew the answers to. So I went the right way, right? I mean, Bigfoot's not going to squash me out here or anything. That would be some shit. That'd be a, one hell of a game over screen. The woods around the house have always been uncomfortably silent. As if they're about to say something, but never do. You got squatched. Now well, that's the end of it. Somebody was burying bodies out here. There's no reason to have a wheelbarrow out in the middle of the forest. Unless you're doing some despicable acts. Just your average the house is exactly like I remembered it, the way I'd been dreaming about it. God, this woman loves this house. I'm going up the, this path because it looks pretty. Man, they did a good job on modeling some of this. Now, as a 17-year-old, I knew exactly what those words were. I was afraid of the house. Are there ghostesses? Phantoms? Mamais? Spocks? Well, I mean... Yeah, let's look through the... There's gonna be eyeballs. Looking in, I felt like the house itself had been waiting for me. Close that, that's not that bad. Made it out to be something it was, and I thought I was going to walk into hell. Potting mix. Okay. Well, somebody's a gardener. Open sesame. Oh, that didn't work. Damn, this is well modeled, dude. This looks like just your average house, except for the paint job. Son of a bitch, that's an ugly paint job on that house. Somebody splashed colors. This was actually one of the first things I, I tried to model in Blender, was a trash can like this. I'm jealous of how they did it. We seriously climbed through a doggy door. Crawling through the doggy door used to be a lot easier when I was 11. You're a creep. I mean, do you still even own this house? I just, I think I'm breaking and entering right now. Even after I inherited the house, inherited the house, inherited the house, the power had been turned off the night we left. Cliche. Their family still owns it. I mean, I just, I hope so. I just went through the doggy door. First time in years. Oh my god. I felt like I was home. Did there really need to be a break between that? Like how after Lewis started working at the cannery, we all got sick of eating salmon. Except our cat, Molly. Don't tell me this is gonna be another one of those stupid games like Home or something. Oh, yeah. Pop out a clown. Well. Great Grandpa Sven built a music box for Barbara. Along with the rest of the house. Bigfoot. I knew it. See? I called it. You're gonna get squatched. And that's the end of it. Mom always told me to stay out of the basement, so I wasn't too surprised when the key didn't fit. 
well, you've already broken in, or you might as well bust that glass down right there and grab that doorknob on the other side. And that's what I would do. Fireplace had a story. Edie told me the bricks came from the original house after it sank. The house looks fine. Unless you're talking about, like, holy sh. The house just sucked the words up. Anyway, this house looks relatively modern, so unless you're talking about economically, I don't really see how it sank. I mean, look at this TV over here. Can I turn that on? The power had been turned off. The power had been turned off. No, I mean, it's... Looks like from a, maybe a few years ago, but it's still, I mean, it's a pretty big flat screen right there, so... I didn't go into this game thinking it was a horror game right off the bat because last time I did that with home I was very disappointed that game the table was still a wreck from the night we left y'all left in a hurry didn't you it was like a bomb had gone off killing everyone but sparing the furniture well I mean not that carpet well somebody went out to eat Chinese I think I'll go upstairs. This door looks inviting. Yeah, I mean, very inviting. Is that the front door? Edie told me once that every finch who ever lived is buried somewhere in the library. Okay. After Milton disappeared, Mom sealed up all the bedrooms. Then Edie retaliated and drilled peepholes. That's creepy. Oh, this room looks cool. I spent a lot of time playing in Great Uncle Walter's room. I think my mom sometimes regretted not sealing it up. Why wouldn't you do this? Is awesome looking. Uncle Walter! Oh, dude. Fa found it! 20,000 leagues under the sea. Turns out, my mom was really good at keeping secrets. Oh. Why would you ruin a perfectly good book? To find out what my mom had been afraid of. She murder people? But I had no idea what was behind that door. Oh, it's gonna make me flop out. I wanted to turn around. No! It's like I had no idea where all this was gonna lead. Oh, you dude, let me back in. That is creepy. Looking at Molly's room through the peephole. Being inside for the first time, I felt like I'd stepped behind a painting. What the hell are you on about? You lived in this house. You just said that like not too long ago. How long did you live in this house? You had to have been in like every room. That's what kids do. Since Edie had spent a lot of time here before my mom sealed the doors. I don't care if they she silt the doors or not. Kids find a way. She only lived to be ten. December thirteenth, nineteen forty seven. Dear diary, I'll be gone soon, but I wanted to tell somebody about what's gonna happen. It started when mom sent me to bed without dinner. I woke up and I was starving. So I looked around for something to eat. My plan is Molly now. What the hell? Gerbil food. It's like gerbil poop. The gerbil food was dry, but I didn't mind it. Are, are you serious? You just ate poop covered carrot. My Halloween candy was all gone. I mean, you didn't get filled up on poop carrot? God, that's gross. Eat the fish. Do it. I thought about... I thought about eating Christopher, but I held back. I mean, I was just joking. Did you... I didn't see a gerbil! No! No! 
You ate the gerbil! This girl is obviously disturbed in so many ways. There's, she's torturing Patrick. He didn't find the crown and save the town, okay? She cut his f***ing arm off. Mom, can I come out now? Sweetheart, it's late. Go to sleep. I ate a poo carrot. I did good, Mommy. Well, at least you got a toilet. I kept eating and eating. Ugh. Oh, you sicko. I ate a lot of things that night. Is that... Was that even real? I mean, you ate poo, Carrot. It wouldn't be a step up to... Then I heard chirping outside my window. Oh yeah, we're gonna eat, we're gonna eat a bird. I heard the barn swallow going back to her nest. I reached out for her. And suddenly... I was a cat! What the f***? Oh, your cat food. Come here. I'm a cat, dude. Stay right there. Now don't you move. I tried to be quiet, but the bird was really scared. I'm gonna get this bird. Come to pussy poo. Is that still, you pigeon? I hope you've grown attached to life, because I'm gonna take it. You hear that? That's the sound of a killer. Come here. I jumped and I almost got her. That's right, take me back to your nest. Alright, she's right I there. I she was getting really tired. She hasn't really gone that far. I doubt she's that tired. Where's the bird? I lost the bird. Oh, there it is. Oh, you anus leech. Now I was up in the big tree. I promised Dad I wouldn't climb it anymore. All I cared about was eating that mama bird. I'm with you. We will. We will eat that bird. Sounded a bit weird, but we're going to. Yes! Yes! And suddenly, I was an owl. First, all what? I heard was the wind. Then I heard little teeth nibbling in the grass. Oh, this is gonna be good. I like this. This is awesome. Ooh, can I die? Aw. Rabbits. Where? Aha! Come to Owl. This is for making me share my wisdom, but never giving me any carrots, rabbit. I'll put your head on Winnie the Pooh's porch. And tell Tigger what you saw. I imagined his face looking up and seeing mine through my talons. I swallowed him up, and I didn't chew one bit. And then I flew off to find something. My mama done told me hunt something for dinner. Come here. She was almost too big to carry. Yeah, but I got her. But I couldn't stop eating. It's I was a shark. What the heck? No! That sucks. Really? Oh, me, me, no. This is awesome. <laughs> I love I it. Off a cliff oh. Into the ocean. And now I'm Echo. Now, I was hungrier than ever. Oh, you're mine. Da, 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 da. Come here. Get 
It's hard to be a shark. I just want to play. I just want to. I just want to eat. Yes. I tore off your flipper, and it tasted really good. That's all you did? Where'd she go? I gotta finish what I started, man. Oh, there she is. Ooh, that's good. Come to me. Yes. Open my eyes, everything had changed. What am I now? I'm a snake? This game is weird, dude. Now I was a monster and I smelled people everywhere. Um, is that a snake or a tentacle? Hold on, bring go back to me. Come back to the screen real quick. I'm a d tentacle, dude. Oh yes. <laughs> yes. I'm the Kraken. I am the Kraken. No, I didn't. I just knocked over like everything. I'm having like the hardest time steering this tentacle. Yeah, I was not quiet about that. Oh, yes. Come to me. I wanted to stop, but also I didn't. Yeah, I don't want to stop either. I need num nums for my beak. Yeah, come to me. Look like a giant worm, to be honest with you. Come on, Captain. Yeah, that wasn't a passenger. Okay. Am I still the tentacle? Aw, oh, I wanted to be something else. Good smell went into an old pipe. I wanted to be something else. I didn't want to be the tentacle anymore. Or something. Holy that is awesome. I am actually no, I'm okay with being the tentacle now. All of my stomach started growling. And suddenly I was being Is mm. keep that story between you and your therapist. Yeah, let's put that. Was that Molly's story? Okay, so Molly's a creep. If she got eight, there's nothing wrong with that. She eats poop carrots. Bedroom with its own even tinier gerbil cage. Oh, it was in the drawer. Okay, she didn't eat the gerbil. I was so scared. Do I get to turn into a cat now, Molly? Just saw Molly. When we adopted a stray kitten, she was the one who named it Molly. Uh, okay, what room am I in now? I spent a lot of time in Great Grandma Edie's room. Can I go back to being the shark? Oh, it's one of those. For years, the Finches have been famous throughout Norway for their fortune and misfortune. One of those clicker things. I used to play with one of these. Odin Finch buries the latest victims of the family curse. His wife, Ingeborg, and their newborn son, Johan. Johan. On January 7th, 1937, he set sail with his family and his house, hoping to leave the curse behind. To drink some Gatorade. But 40 foot waves off the coast of Washington Send the house and Odin to the bottom of the sea. Odin's daughter Edie, with husband Sen and baby Molly, step ashore on their new home, Orcas Island. Ain't nothing wrong with that. Oh, that was it? Oh, sure, it's the only one in my friend Bigfoot. I knew it! See, it keeps coming. I'm gonna be Bigfoot. And somebody is getting squatched. Dude, it's happening. Are you gonna play the tape? The power had been turned off. Power had been turned off. I mean, there's a VCR. Oh, there's no power. Son of a. B Open the door. 
Nice shack carpet, man. If K left on the house was the pink bathroom. It was a pretty big trace. Yeah. I'm I'm saying. Oh, cool. Another lock. Same key? Oh bullshit. There's a secret in this bathroom. It's in the last place you would look. It isn't in the cupboard. It's hidden in this book. That was dumb. Very well hidden. There's no way that key opened both those locks. There's no way. I'm going to be missing a lot of stuff. I already know it because I'm going to have to get on with the game because it's taking longer than need be anyway. Push. Get out of here. And that's probably where we're going to end the first episode. If you enjoyed this, please feel free to watch me again when I post my next video. Don't know... And that's gonna be this room looks weird. Anyway, bye everybody!